Hello ladies and gents, this is the Rev, and now that we've gotten away from that nasty blight town, we are on to the next section. So, to get to the next area where we're going is the underground forest. So, let's get to it. Whoop, I gotta start by going the right way. See, I changed some armor around. I went and I scouted out the area. Kind of got an idea what's going on. Um, if you want to uh, explore, do much anything in this area, you're really going to want to go in. First things first. I'll show you when we get there. But what you do is you hang to the left side. Haul ass. Because there are a crap load of defenders. So if you haul ass... You can make it to their leader and then once you make it to the leader you can join the coven and you can go from there um, once you do that you then go and talk to the um, night outside and then you go and you talk to him again and you wind up getting this Yes, this is my new toy. But thought I'd give her a run. For its money. Okay. <sighs> Actually, I am in the wrong area. Ha ha ha. Eventually, you do come down to this area here and actually do a lot. Actually, it's more, I think, towards the end of the game when you're fighting the four kings. We'll get there eventually as we go. Like I say, I'm only researching just enough to do videos. I'm not looking far ahead. You know, it's more about playing and exploring and having a good time. You know, I'm trying to help you guys as well as myself learn this game. I think I've gotten a lot better than since the first video, especially when it comes to just fighting in general. You know, this game, they talk about how difficult it is, and it is. But fact that you can upgrade all of your weapons really evens the playing field. They could do better. They could add more. But okay, so the shortcut to get to where we're going is an easy one. Oh, what I something I didn't show you is after you rung the two bells. Something happens. Someone appears. Yes. Now we're going to have to stop here a second. I will go in and turn the audio up so you can hear this guy. Okay, it should be nice and loud. I am pleased to see you well. Is it something urgent? And then what you do is if you have any stuff that you don't want, right? Say we'll give them some of this, because I got a crap load of that. Oh, look at that. You get souls for it. So I went through, and basically everything that you've been collecting since the beginning of the game, right? Uh when it comes to armors and swords I've kept only the second tier and better nothing of the normal stuff here's that flameberg stats on that bad boy it's the uh, strongest single-handed weapon without having to uh, use two hands so it's not bad you know I roll with that and the other main weapon, and this is anyone that's going to play. If you want the easiest weapon to handle, uh, easiest weapon to learn, timing, everything, because you use it directly with your shield, you can keep your shield up the whole time, is, we'll get there right here, the Hallbergs. These guys are bad. Oh, cancel that. No, I show stats. Okay, see? 
We got 215 regular plus 69. It's good again. It's okay against stuff. There are magical ones and such that you can get. Farewell. So now we shall go. And of course, there's this guy. Still oh, trying. I'm sorry. Miracles, was it? Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe you should just kiss my horse. Just, oh, oh. So you might be wondering, you know, when you got up from that bonfire, you didn't see the guy from the beginning. Well, the guy that you first talked to when you get there, for some reason, is now in that lower berg. And if you would have gone further to the right instead of reascending, uh... That is cool looking armor. Stone armor, by the way. Give you guys a quick check. Uh, this is one of the things, this is one of the types of armor that you'll find uh, in the section where we're going to. This is one of the main armors and the Elite Knight armor set. See, ooh, see, kind of looks like, you know, the one from the beginning of the story. You know what I'm saying? Eh. Anyways, so let's go see how this new store does. Uh, and I'm gonna go back to that armor. Cause look at that, 91. It's almost twice what all the other armors I've come across so far are. Backstab. Ooh. And that kind of sucks because before I could take these guys down with a single pop. Oh well, good thing now is when you see that armor like that, oh look, something I can sell to the demon, or I should say give to the demon. Yeah, this guy's still one or two notches away from uh, being as good as my other weapon, but... He handles these guys just fine. Only problem is, is it's a little slower uh, in the in the execution. It's not that straight stab. And you know, I find it interesting that you know only the Hallbergs. I'm sure I'm mispronouncing that. St uh, do this short kind of stab thing. Uh, most of the other weapons don't. You can you've got these wild swings. Right. Nobody wants that. It doesn't accomplish anything. You can see I've already rekindled that fire, kicked that up so it fills my fasks to uh, 10 every time. And here is our boy. Well, hello again. Oh, you seem loud. to be doing all right. Need anything forged? Just my personality, good sir. See, and here we go. So we need to get the large titanic shards to get these guys kicked up to the next levels. Interesting. Raw flame birds, raw battle axe. Versus I wonder what the difference between the two is. Because it takes a shard either way. See, I, I've never understood what those negative numbers mean. Anyways, okay. So, purchase item. Right here. Now, above this, the, he sells a... Um, it's basically a key, right? But it's this little round shield thingy. Um, it's not a shield, it's too small for that, but it's a little round, I can't think of the word, um, that you use to open up the section to get into the next section that we're going to be going to. Um, so, and that's 20,000 souls. You know, and he sells some basic car crap. You know, as always, anything good you're going to find, you're going to find in the world. And as always, you want to repair the thing before you head on in. Don't get yourself killed. Uh, Neither I? of us want to see you go hollow. How 
Okay. So let's see, we're gonna put that back to my big boy. If you're curious as to why, see that physical uh, damage 285? All right. That's with the Flamberg. That's with the Battle Axe. That's with my boy. See that? And we are just under the amount allowed so that we can do our thing. Okay, so. Heading downstairs. Now, you will fight the first of these headless, one-armed, uh, lightning-shooting SOBs. There are many bosses. They're not that difficult, as with everything. Dodge, 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 baby. You know, keep your shield up. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay. So, here we go. We are in our new area. This is we're going to be spending the next, probably, episode or two. Uh... I know there's one boss for sure in here, and I think, actually, there, I think there's two. There's the wolf, and then there's the hydra. Beyond that, I'm not real sure. Oh, and this is what you get to fight. Oh, look at that, and I'm an idiot, and I walked right into it. Same thing the uh, jackasses do in... Uh, Light Town. I hate those stupid things. Now there's a guy off here that's going to be set off. There he is. Come on, Buffle. Whoop. I suck. Oh, I really suck. Again, I sheesh. Whoop. And these guys drop. Um, stuff to help with bleeding now. Here we go. Okay. This is the way to armor another Black Knight, which is a medium mini boss. And at the very, 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 very bottom, Zehydra. We shall get to that later. Um, you actually, the most, the boss that I've seen actually the most, uh, you know, on television ads, things of that nature, is the one that we're going to be coming up on here soon. So, once again, you can see why that's the weapon I really enjoy using. It's my weapon of choice for the simple fact that it's got a great reach, it's quick, and it's a straight threat. There's no wind up. Okay, so. First things first, when you come here, this right here will be an illusionary wall. So, you're going to want to rest. At it. Now, I'm going to show you guys some different stuff, and then we'll look at the, uh, look at getting into that boss battle. Because it's actually a little bit of a ways to get to. Okay, so, I am a friend of the Covenant. Which means no one's going to attack me. But if you weren't, you would take an whole ass. See this over here? And, see these guys? They'd all be attacking you. You have to, basically, you can run through it, and then you talk to this. Ah, thou dost cometh. How fares ye? Wow, My wow. hopes for thee are of the highest. Okay, hold on a second here. Sorry, folks, I really gotta turn that down. Let's try that now. Ah, thou That's dost cometh. Better. How fares ye? My hopes for thee are of the highest. Do not such a hope shatter with foul disproportion. Yeah, okay, love you too, honey. Anyways, so now we start getting into the fun stuff. And you can see there's bits and pieces of stuff. The stone armor that I have on, I'll show you guys that first. That's real easy to get. Unfortunately, it didn't come with a weapon. 
There we go. Now, the other problem is that I just noticed as we came in, the guy that sells the weapons, his ass is at the bottom of Blight Town. Makes it kind of hard to buy anything else from him. Anyways, okay, so we'll work our way through here. I don't remember where exactly it is, but there's a whole bunch of crap you got to kill. You can avoid it, I think. And I'm not sure if... Uh, is that where we need to go? It might be. I don't know. Hmm. What do I hear? Not these little guys. These things are like non-existent. They don't... They're not what I would call difficult to fight. I don't even think they follow you. Trying to figure out where the stupid boss in this area though. That'll probably be the majority of the video. Oh, that didn't sound good. That's something big coming my way. <laughs> oh, that is so bad. Oh, get... Run, 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 run. Okay, so he's a little still OP'd for me. And the best way to kill those guys is not to do it in their valley. But... Is he following me still? Okay. There we go. Hit the old flask. Ooh, wait, yeah. Well, yeah, I'm going to have to. See, here's the problem. I've got things geared. Ooh, I wonder what kind of distance my... Because it takes a wind-up. So let's see if this guy... I've been playing around a little bit with the sorcery. See, this character really isn't designed for anything good. Uh, he's kind of just a jack of all trades. Because balance does not equate into effective. Now, what do we got? Okay. Mm-hmm. We don't want to go down there. I know you can, uh... Those guys aren't that hard to get around either, so... We'll just look around. See, now I, I could have swore it was up and to the left up there. See, now I have no idea if, what these guys are. Yeah, I think they're evil. Yeah. I don't know, you gonna attack me? Oh. Ow! Woo. He's got quite a punch to him, doesn't he? Which that other one's coming over here now. Nope, little one is. Ooh. Hey, chance to try my fireball. Suck it. You would think it that would do more damage. Ooh. Once again, there's a reason I like. Uh, uh. <laughs> Seriously, really? <coughs> Pardon me, folks. 
So that would be the reason why. Now we're gonna. Now of course I'm gonna have to go back and kill him. Um, but before I do that, this is the way that you can go before that gate's open. There's some things. First, you're going to want to come in here and you're going to want to kill these guys because they will come up behind you and they will and they will jack you up. See that? I smoked them good and I still got hurt. And that takes care of the poison, my friend. So if you want to come do this area and work it and farm it for... Now this is a big wall. We'll see what respawns, what doesn't in here. Because there are... Oh, here we go. Hey, big boy. Now, these guys I've found, I can actually take a couple hits... not bad they drop 600 as with anything it depends on how many come at you at once okay so over this way that will poison you so you're going to want to do that and then you're going to want to turn around and you're going to want to watch the sky that's right this guy drops a bunch of souls or something some such thing this, of course, part more purple moss. Yep, or blood, whatever. Okay, so. I found that I like to just run the area in this, in these are, um. Ooh, maybe, oh, look at that. I think we found the boss. Oh, how lucky of us. Unfortunately, there's another one of those things. Because they will poison you. So, see that? Snakehead. Bad. Do, do, do. What do we have? Ooh, it's another jerk off. Ooh, that was uncool. Ooh, you don't want to let him... Okay, if he casts that spell, what it does is, is it slows you down and locks you up so you can barely move. So it's basically a massive slow spell. Not good for you. Okay. Yeah, I think this is it. This is the way we go to uh, fight our boss. So... As always, I'm going to give her a shot. I don't see anybody to summon, but then I'm also not in my human form. But you can enter from that way, too. It's probably the exit. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, no, it's the Moonlight Butterfly. crap and I'm not geared right for him. Ah, uh, shoot. At all. Okay. 
Oh, look at that, and he even blew the thing out of my hand. What a jackass. <sighs> okay, so to beat this guy, you got to, of course, dodge those things. And you... Um, First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna rest the bonus point. Okay, we're going to attune magic. Alright, heavy soul arrow. Okay. I think that's all I needed to do. Because now we go in. We've already got that. That's what we swipe out. And we're gonna find that sorcerer's catalyst. There we go. So we got two ranged weapons. How's my weight? My weight is over, of course. So uh, this is gonna suck. Magic resistance. So yeah, it's... Ugh. Wow. So everything's lighter, but nothing uh, has a magical defense. How funny. Oh well. We're about speed right now, so I guess... We'll go with that. Okay. And we'll give her one more shot now that we know exactly where we're going. It's not too bad of a run. You know, so it's a question on whether or not uh, that guy responds every time. Because if he does, it's going to suck. Although I'd assume I could probably just run right by him. Yep, there he is. Those things follow me? Nope, they're heading back. Okay, so we got to fight Big Boy again. Was just fugly. See that? Now I'm in trouble. All I can do is back up. I can't roll. Can't do nothing. Should have been drinking on my juice. See, this is why also you don't let these guys live. I shouldn't have ran by those. Okay, I'm going to do this one more time with you guys, and then I'll cut out all this crap. And you guys will just see me kicking his butt. They drop something besides a stupid moss. I have plenty of fucking moss. Oh well. Like I said though, the good thing about it is you can always feed it to the gimp thingy at the beginning. So. Was he still walking around? Oh crap, no, he's right there. Haha. Ah. Ha. Who's your daddy boy? Since I died, I lost all those. Ooh, look at that retrieval. So Oh. 
Seriously, really? I mean, uh, very annoying. I have no idea what they drop if they drop anything. So the one thing I didn't do real quick was. Nope, doesn't look like there's anything on there. You never know, could be treasure chests all over the place. So there's a lot of different ways to take this guy on. What I've heard, this would be the best. Alright, you big cuckoo cock ahead. Where are you? Oh, that actually did something. But surely we'll win the race. These are supposed to be pretty heavy. Ooh. Now when he does this, you are supposed to go to town. Ow. Ah. He's just kicking my booty, isn't he? Come on now. We can do one monster by ourselves. We don't need no help. Yes. Oh. We did it! Oh, I got a humanity. Oh ho ho! Seriously, really? Okay, whatever. Is there anything down there you could do? More likely than not, I assume so. All right, what's over here now? Hmm. I hope I didn't piss off the Covenant. You should never know. I also never know what the hell you're going to run into. I'm going all the way the hell to back up here, so... Hi! Watchtower Basement Key. Divine Ember. Why does something tell me that this isn't all that there is to this? It's an old smith is what it is. Huh. Weird. I will have to research that. Because, you know, you'd think you'd be able to pick the shit up. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. Oh, well. Oops. What I do want is one human, so at least I got a little bit of. Ugh, my flask is dead. Um, a little bit of health here. As you never know. Who, what, when, where, why. There's nothing. Nothing at all. Wow, well that was really friggin' disappointing. I know that there's a special weapon that you can make out of it. Which I think is the whole point. Special effects, huh? See, down below would be Mr. Hydra. 
hope this way I can show you him. Yeah. That's where he is. That's the other monster. I, I totally forgot about this guy. We still got to figure out where that damn wolf is. Because I thought this was the wolf. So, what we shall do is we shall head back. Of course you can't. And now, that elite knight warrior. I'm going to show you guys right where that is. So if you come over here, and you'll know you found it, because shit will hit the fan. Didn't this crap get knocked down on my way? Oh. Okay, see, see, big boy, we getting up here? Right here? This is where you'll find um, maybe not because there should be two of them so be real careful not to lose all these souls although she's that's about about enough for a level at this point Okay, so, it's around here, <laughs> I just don't remember where, anyways, when you come in, you'll be able to find it, it is a, uh, is that how we came in, yeah it is, okay, so from coming in, this is how I know it, you'll see it off to the right, so it's up this way, I think I might have already killed the guys off. Nope, there they are. There it is. And we'll haul the hell out of here now. Don't get caught up on the trees. Because there's no, there's no point in fighting them. Run in, grab that armor, then get the hell out. I mean, seriously, there's no reason. You're just going to wind up getting your ass handed to you. Oh, really? And there's nothing you can do while this guy's doing this to you. Come on. Screw that, man. It's okay, I can die right here because then I'll get my... S <sighs> Alrighty, folks, so I am going to do some work and find where those bosses are, get us set up and ready to go, and I'll show you how to beat the next two bosses and how to get to them. Alrighty, thanks for watching. See you next time. This has been The Rev. Hi, folks. Another little quick little thing here. I found a way to beat these guys. I'm going to cut this in in the next video. Uh, may or may not start it, but what you do is you from Mr. Hydra, which, by the way, is right there. Hey, handsome. Okay. You got these three guys here. Now, through trial, error, and getting my head kicked in, I have found a, a, a way to beat them. Ooh, but you gotta be quick. You gotta get behind the street. And then as soon as they do this, one of them usually gets close enough. See these guys? That's a lot of death coming at me. But, with patience, you can either snipe them, You do that. Ah. Come on, come on, you know you wanna. Come on, I'm standing right here. Oh ah. go.
Oh crap. Oh! See? <sighs> okay, so this is the only way I've found to beat these guys if you don't have a super OP weapon and you don't want to spend all day running around them trying to get anywhere. <laughs> this is what you do. So. Alrighty, guys. So here we go again. Yes! That's one down. Ooh, 2,000 souls a pop. You know, I might be worth the time. Might be worth the time. Depends on how many of these little bastards there are, though. Oh, oh, too much. Get greedy, die. That's the way it works, man. Hey, handsome. Oh, this guy's almost dead. Come on. You know you want a piece of this. Yes. Alright, I did it. I have no idea what's in here now. Alrighty, folks, what I want to show you real quick. This is a little adverb here. I'm not sure quite how I'll use it, but I want to show you guys how to take those three little mofos out. Thanks for watching. This has been The Rev.